All right. This is video two because I just screwed up the first one. But I just did this whole thing where I opened these packages. I have to say thank you to John. I have to say thank you to Cliff. I did a video with the Astro Van, I guess last week or something, and uh, I was showing you things that you can, should, scavenge from an Astro Van if you find one in the junkyard. And I mentioned the two hard points, these triangle points here, that you'll find in the back of the van. So Cliff sent me two of these, and these are real cool. Um, they're super heavy duty. You can see the size of them. Really neat stuff. The only issue with these is that when you you measure the height here, it's it's over three. It's like eleven sixteenths of an inch tall. That that's over three quarters of an inch tall here. John sent me these. These come off of. He said they came off of a Sprinter van. They're just as heavy duty. Uh, but the neat thing about these D rings is. I have to put some oil on them. When they're folded down, you can see they're nowhere near as tall as the ones that came out of the Astro Band. These are only a uh, half inch tall. So, the neat thing about, oh yeah, these are gonna need to be worked. This one here is pretty loose. All right, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna take over the van and show you the deck and talk about exactly what I wanna do so you'll understand. Got my super safe, not sketchy at all, uh, Widowmaker <laughs> step stool ladder. So if you look under here, you can see the decking. And by the way, I am going to cinch in this curve. I like the curve. We all know it's a little too much. So I'm going to be cutting this piece of Unistrut back and this piece back, and I'll be cinching that in at some point. If you hold this in place here, if I hold that flush with the top, you should be able to see, it's hard for me, the sun is in my eyes, but you should see some decking under it. So there's gonna be about a quarter of an inch of wood still under this thing. The idea is, this will go in one of the screw holes. I'll trace this with a pencil. I'll get a uh, router up here with a straight cutting bit. I'll remove that material. This will, one of the bolts will go right through here and this will be going through the deck board, holding it down, right down into the Unistrut. And these will be super hard, tough lashing points. Easier to lash down surfboards, lumber, everything. Yes, you can lash things down to the outside of this Unistrut. The issue is then your straps going from here on an angle. So things can still slide a bit. Whereas with these, I'm gonna strategically place these so they're a little tighter in here. And then once this is up, nothing can slide past it on the deck. And the idea about mortising is so that this is flush with the top of the deck is so that when I slide things up from the back, uh, things will slide right across this deck nice and smooth without getting hung up on these things. That's the idea. I don't remember how long ago it's been. I guess it's been a couple months since I put these deck boards down. I did oil them. They've been getting beat on by the Southern California sun. We've had quite a bit of rain since I put these up here, holding up pretty good. When I do this, I will probably sand the deck down and put another coat of oil on it. So you always want to oil your wood. Very important, very important to take care of your wood, fellas especially hardwood. You want to make sure you got plenty of oil on that. So that's that. Have a great day. Be good to one another. Hope you dig it. Um, it's going to be a hot one today. Not working today. And I start doing some work next week. So it won't be a whole lot of uh, Astro Van videos for a little while, probably. Oh, and by the way, I do plan on using these inside the van because now I've got four of them. <clears throat> the idea would be, once I get this uh, built out in here, I'll find a couple high points, well, four of them, likely, because uh, I'm thinking in terms of being able to strap things across the top uh, to suspend them, and so those will be pretty cool. So I think it's neat if you can figure out a way to reuse any of the hardware that you're pulling out of your van. 
uh, when you do your van build. It's just kind of neat to do that. You save money too. So again, have a great day. Be good to one another. I'll catch you next time. Astro Van Tribe.